everybody, it's Josh and Yai here with the next episode of The Wolf Among Us. Where is he? He's right here, his name is Big B. And I'm Josh and Yai, if I did say that before, because I did. I'll repeat myself one more time. I'm Josh and Yai. And here we go. Last we left off, we beat the crap out of, uh, out of the woodsman, because he was beating some, some girl who apparently Big B has a crush on, even though he's just met her. Uh, so we're going to these apartments. She's supposed to meet us here to give a police report at our apartment instead of the office. Whatever. Anyway, let's uh, check this out. Luxury apartments. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. Luxury apartments. Well, it is where you live. Have you never seen that sign before there, Bigby? Let's take a look around. Probably nothing out here, but just in case. Oh, no, there is something. Ah, that's why you... That's why you're thorough. Sometimes be a Stay off grass. Dagnabbit kid. Alright. Seems to be telling us where to go. Straight. <gasps> Suddenly, there was a rustling in the bushes. Uh, it looks like Red Riding Hood. Come on, <laughs> stay off the grass. Come on I out. Said that. I think it's, I'm going to go ahead and say that's Red Riding Hood. All right, all right. Just because of the red coat. Beauty. Oh, beauty. Ah, Hello, sleeping baby. beauty. I wasn't expecting anyone. Uh, I know this why'd you hide? a little odd. Yeah, a little bit. Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. What? Well, no. Can't. Is there something I should know? Damn it. I'm late. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Hey, why is everyone... He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Sure. You promise? I, I told I told you I wouldn't. Thank you, Big B. I but why? What is the deal with like later. the men I will, in, I have to go. in this game being douches? All right. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I I appreciate it. Okay, get it. Baby. Move along. Change my mind. Jeez. I mean, from the outside, those apartments don't look that bad, to be honest. The frog's apartment, that was, that was pretty crummy. Frog and the woodsman. Nice. Sleeping on the job. Well, let's check the mail. Let's, uh... Let's do that. Bill. Bill. Bill junk mail. mail. But today's the day, isn't... Oh. Day in a row. But to be honest, the way I see it, no mail is good mail because that means that means that means no bills. Bills suck if you're not uh, needing to pay them yet. Just so you know. Hey, you wink. Does he look awake? Hmm. Probably for the best. Bigby, you're a detective. What the hell? What is this? Did that not wake him? Okay. Well, I guess we'll move on this way. See anything over here? I see the sign there, and there's a call button. That's it. Okay, let's look at that. What a, Ooh, what are you? Damn thing fell off again. Oh. No one... No one wants your name on there. How much longer is this gonna go on? D okay, just take it easy. It's just a sticker. I was kind of kidding about it, man. You think the sheriff would get a permanent listing? All right. Don't get no respect around here. 
That's what Bakery says. It's not what he says, but he doesn't. I'm just trying to stick up for him, alright? Okay, in there, look, here we go. Who is it? Who are you? Bigby, hey, wait up. Have you seen really? my wife? I'm trying to go home. Have you seen Beauty? Oh, it's Beast. Haven't seen her. Nope, haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. Hmm. Maybe I should take in the neutral stance on that. Though he kind of seems a little, uh, insecure. God, everything's so pink and purpley in this. I assumed it was Big B's apartment, actually. Thank you. Otherwise, it'd be a little weird that he's B and E and someone else, someone else's Damn. place. Should have cracked a window. Did you fart? What the hell? What are you doing? Oh, you're just gonna wash your face. Okay, gotcha. Cliche. After a rough night, you just wash your face, wash all the. Grime and nasty and bullshit away. What a night. You don't have a bathroom sink you've done that in? Just saying. Alright. Open the fridge. What's good to eat? Why do I even own this? Huff. <laughs> Huff and puff. That's kinda funny. A little bit. In the freezer? Ice cubes. Not even. You are a sad, sad man wolf. It's a little pathetic, I won't lie. Alright, what do we got? What's on your desk there, Bigby? Let's get it. Bluebeard's file. Bluebeard? Who the hell's Bluebeard? Never trusted this guy. Who is he? Chinese? You want some little chai chai? Don't even remember ordering that. Probably a bad sign. Dude, you gotta take care of yourself. It's, it's a little sad. You're a grown wolf. And or man. You should... You should be able to uh, clean up after yourself. Should help. Who is that? What? So you got a pig living in... No. It's a pigsty. <laughs> no, but seriously, you got, a, you got a giant pig on your couch. What's the deal here? Alright, let's take a look. Yep. Yep, that's a pig. And uh, let's, let's poke him. Hey, Big B. Hey, Pig B. I'm in your chair, huh? Seems that way. I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. Hey, don't you snort at me. Well, at least he seems nice compared to everyone else. Really, that's where you can sit? Got a smoke? You got some messed up teeth there, Pig. Your name's Pigby. I don't know. Colin, no. Pigby. Pigby and Bigby. The ultimate duo. Thanks. A couple That's... thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. It's a little this odd. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the <laughs> like this. Because he blew down this house. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Come on. That's a little dramatic. 
I feel like I'm royally me. ruining this. Nope. The house like, didn't blow itself down, Bigby. With my decisions. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh, it would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. Really? It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. Really? If that was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm doing my best here. He's gonna play that card Clearly every time. That is Move down my heart. Blah, 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 blah. The selfishness with oink, the oink, oink. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed mm, to have a yummy, fresh yummy start people. here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair. But it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, I help look people. At your hands. I help people. Well, he deserved it. That guy was an asshole. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. It's your true. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables. Yes. Sometimes I take them to the farm. Fuck you. Damn. You think my job is easy? You I try feel like keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. I'm making everyone hate me. Think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big the and big, being bad. bad. Mm. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. <laughs> That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Mm, no. Nope. Not actually. Name one. Two people. Beauty. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I told her I'd lie for her. Right. Yeah. That's real nice of you. <laughs> Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know How long you do like you this live? whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Ooh, well, like maybe Snow if White. my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep Big talking. Big Band Snow, sitting right, in a tree. Just give me a drink, please. K I S S I N G. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds. That yeah, was unnecessary, but before I. Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right, probably. Probably. Thanks, Big B. Ugh. You can keep the glass, too. Where's the pig? Is he here? Or is he let me look? Pig, get it! Pig B! God damn it. What? <laughs> I don't think that's gonna help there. Big B! Is that snow? snow. Oh. Come with me. Alright. Alright, Snow. Hmm. You my girl. Snow. Snow! What? Sorry, I'm... What is it? Where, Where are we, we going? going? Out in front of the building. We have to get there. Hi. Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. Who are you? Who is that? These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. Okay. You're kind of freaking me out there, Snow. What 
is that? Is that roadkill? Oh. Okay. Oh, the security guard. He's gone. He gone. He gone. No, security guard who's asleep and I don't know who you are, but you're dead. Pick it up, Big B. Pick it up. <gasps> oh. You knew this girl? Is oh, that's sad. She's not a Mundy, right? Oh, that's sad. Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. A working girl? A working girl? I don't... I mean, I'm a working... Oh. Oh, that's sad. There's something in her mouth. A woodsman. He attacked her and I stepped in. He threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. I doubt it was the woodsman. He's, he's, he's a cock, but... It's just... Terrible. So, who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Then, I came to get you right away. No one else was with you? No. Big P, did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. Man. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. I'll have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. Man. That sucks. I really thought she was, was going to be, like, important. But, uh, well, she is important, but you know what I mean, like, alive. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp, or something with magic attached to it. Well, the axe, it's looking like the axe, but I doubt it's, I doubt it's him. What is... I'll, I'll get it. I'll get it. Hold on. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind it of was the toad? It was the toad. Ooh, we gotta make it. Ooh, what is that? Ooh. It's oh, it's her ribbon. A ribbon. With the ring. There's. Some kind of symbol here. Huh. Well, she was working for someone, right? Maybe it was that guy. Neither do I. There's some blood. <sighs> I'm, I'm sorry. This is just so surreal. Um, what, what do you want to do You're actually handling next? this pretty well, Snow. Well, we should probably investigate more. We still have some time. We should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Alright, well, I got the ring. There's the door. Well, what happens if we talk to you again? Hey, Snow. You alright? Yes, thanks. You're welcome. But you should hurry. We don't have much hey, time. Pushy. Left. We should head back inside soon. Alright, yeah. Well, what are we gonna do with this head? Alright, nothing over here. Nothing up top. Nothing on the ground. Hey, baby. What over here? Beauty was kind of acting weird, but I doubt it was her either. Let's see. Nobody there. What, you were expecting something? 
Like it's like you're on punked. Surprise! Alright, I do know that there's a pile of blood or a, a puddle of blood. Come on, Bigby! Walk! You're a wolf. You'd be more agile than that. Don't touch it. Ugh. Something else over there. Alright, fine. Touch it. Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, yes. maybe. I would you touch it. I guess fables can't get diseases. Alright, what are you? What are you? No signs that it's been here long. No signs that it's been here short. Whatever it is. That brick. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Well, now you have it. Alright, trash can. Is the rest of her body in here? No. Just some loose trash. Alright, what about... Come on. Yep, more blood. Oh, wait. Someone might have hopped the Cut fence, themselves. Got caught, and left the trail I found. Yeah, out. there you go. Look at that. Blood. Detective work. Still wet. Sharp enough. All right. Come on. Back to snow. Okay, show her the jeans. What are you doing? Better to be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. What, you think it was snow? Or are you just comparing material? Ugh. We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business okay. office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? I would say this is a message. How did this happen? That's what I would say. This is a message. A message? Don't know for I don't know, for, I don't know, know who. Bigby. I get complaints at the office all the time, but just what about this makes you think that? The placement. Whoever did this isn't exactly hiding it. The placement of the head, it's exact, purposeful. She was placed here precisely for us to Twice find. All of us. Well, yes. I guess you're right. The killer wanted us to know what they had done. All right. So. I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. Who's Crane? Ichabod. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting King mayor. Cole. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway. So we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. I know do you don't what you like need him, to do. But he's our boss. This is part of the job. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Okay. Hopefully, he can be rational about it. I, I, I don't know if, if I don't know him enough to really. I just don't want him interfering. Say he he's a douche or not? Seems like he thinks he is, but as far as I'm concerned, just tell him whatever. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can Dr. take a look Swinehart. at it. I'll meet you at the business office. <laughs> I don't know if I would ever go to a doctor named Dr. Swinehart. Okay. What is this? Who are you people? And why are you here? What are you blind? Why you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just really? walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. Exactly. And, here. and what great work you do, Sheriff. Hmm. What are you gonna do? Step up, I dare you. Genuine. Step up. Yeah, so I thought. Yeah, fuck you. Damn. Everyone here is a douche. Yes, I see. I, I, you 
Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Cool. Yes, Lordship. of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You well, asked kind of a me dick. a question. Never mind. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a disaster. It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Maybe you should oh, get your head chopped off by the headless he horseman. Thinks. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, the I have half a mind say. to fire the both of you. No, 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 I meant the pimp, the pimp, the pimp, the pimp. From what we've been able to get. Damn it. He was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. No. Nothing certain yet. I would find him. Get him in here the if that's all you have to go on. No, 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 no. You no, need no, to get no. a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. Damn it. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. It's already yes. a douche. Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Ugh. Where is the bottle of wine Does there happen to be a happy purchase? ending? God, Don't guess it. bother. Forget it. Snap his neck, Can't man. Anything, right? Come on, Bigby. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. You're an asshole. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could have gone better. Well, a little bit. Maybe we should have dragged him out. I meant the out. pimp. Damn For it. It's worth. I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. Oh. Crane doesn't like people smoking and never mind. Smoke away. Who gets a message? What is this this early? Crane. Ugh. It doesn't really matter the time of day. A mere scent of stress and he's out the door. Is that a flying is, is he gone? I remember yes, seeing that from like screenshots and trailers. Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Ichabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. Why are your eyes hollow? Mm. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? Pissed. Hasn't been a great morning, Buffkin. Sorry. Eh, not your fault. Thanks for asking, though. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. Mm, not sure that was any more. The fairy tale specific. books. Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. Thanks, Buffkin. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here, somewhere. All right. We'll at well, least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buff can find them. If In I can get out of this cutscene. Maybe the mirror can help. Ah, I really have to get this mirror. appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. All right. We're going to leave it off here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and investigate next time. Very interesting story so far. Um, I meant to say the pimp, damn it. Not the woods. I know it's not the woods. It's, it's more likely the pimp. Anyway, uh, if you like this video, click the invitation for more. Please, please, please subscribe, like, share it with your friends if, if you want to help this channel grow. And uh, I will see you next time. Toodles!